Congratulations, mate, on uh, disrupting disrupting the working class. He edits to see himself. Thinks he's a journalist. They can't hate you guys because you're green. Carbon neutral. Yeah. Carbon neutral. They'll find a reason. Yeah. Uh, probably you got jobs. Work. They don't like jobs. Friday, though, yeah. yeah. Of your mini for Rebel News in Melbourne, Australia, where Extinction Rebellion is back at it. They've got massive numbers of about 25 here. Hey, everyone, go talk to him. How you doing, guys? Don't push, don't push, don't push, darling, don't push. You're all right. You carry on disrupting the working class during a cost of living crisis. I reckon that'll get them on board. How do you want anyone to take you serious on climate science when you're still wearing a mask? Fast fashion fuels the climate crisis. So why is he wearing a mask? You know those masks? You know what they did to the climate? The masks. The COVID masks. He'll cut it and edit it to suit himself, so don't even give it to him. We can go live. Do you want to go live and tell the world? Do you reckon disrupting the working class during a cost of living crisis is the way to get the working class on board? Immense. Is the climate science settled or is the COVID science? Does this lot disrupting the working class during a cost of living crisis, yeah. do you think they're going to get much, many supporters on board? I don't think any at all. You can care about things and be passionate, but not like this. I think of it the same way that when the vegans shut off uh, the road there a few years ago and people trying to get to doctor's appointments or all those sort of things, it's like you're just making people more frustrated and your views potentially unheard. I don't think they're convincing anyone with what they're doing right now. Like. I think the drumming circles in St Kilda get a bigger audience than that, so. I count more officers than protesters. I'm genuinely starting to feel bad for this lot. So let's talk about the empathy that you guys have so much of. Here we go. The empathy and humility is walking straight for me. Do you guys know how to critically think? Have you ever critically thought one day in your life. And it's all down to climate change. You're regurgitating the mainstream narrative. Do you know how to critically think? Is it possible the help they need is fine? No. False alarm. Why do you think it's such a massive crowd? <laughs> this is almost as serious as COVID. Is that COVID or climate? The same scientists who got COVID wrong that you want us to listen to? Are they the same scientists that say it's okay to chop off your penis and create a prosthetic vagina? I, I, I say so. You don't believe in that? Of course not. You're what we call a transphobe bigot, anti-science, shame on you. This is the future. Have you ever had a critical thought in your life? I'm getting the feeling this has been a really effective protest and anybody in the vicinity has been convinced. Are you going to go green now because uh, they've disrupted the city? Well, no. All right, you're, shame on you. But you're the only guy that took a flyer. No, I just, I just, I'm just taking you're, a look. you're being polite. Yeah, yeah, I'm just taking a look and see. I'm going to... Yeah. You're going to throw it out. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Do you reckon you guys have convinced anyone around here to your cause? It just, I, I feel like it's a pretty low energy event. I don't know, dude. You just look at these people and you go, they're lost. And they want something to believe in and something to feel good about. But you can do it in different ways. Do you just regurgitate the mainstream media's narrative? No? Do you need them to tell you what to think? No? Can't have a thought of your own? Didn't think so. Can I ask, who got more wrong, the COVID scientists or the climate scientists? No? Huh? It's a protection racket, that's all we know. If you're nothing like this sad bunch, make sure to head over to rebelstore.com.au and get yourself one of these t-shirts because you've been right and you deserve to be referred to by your correct pronouns told you so. rebelstore.com.au, check out all the other merch, but buy one of these, wear it proudly, let the world know that you do not fall for this nonsense. rebelstore.com.au, Look good, stand for something, let the world know, and support your favorite news network. So we've just seen in there 
Telegram group sent out to the mass protest because not everybody here got the memo. Don't, in capital, engage with him. He will edit his footage to make you look stupid. I don't need to edit to make you look stupid. You do that all by yourself. Do you want more lockdowns? Hello. More lockdowns? Is that what you're after? More lockdowns, guys? Oh, good, thanks, Polly. How are you? They don't have jobs, so I don't think they affected them much. Have you guys ever had jobs? Thank a job. Have you had a job before? Yeah, yeah. Don't engage. Don't engage. We'll take that yeah, as a clear it. no. You saved her, bro. You saved her. She almost told me she had no job. <laughs> Can I have rosemary? No, don't. Don't give me rosemary. They're very confused. Their messaging isn't getting through from top to bottom. She wants to give me rosemary. He says, no rosemary. I think I deserve rosemary. The only thing going extinct here is the numbers of this group. It's pretty sad. Thinks he's a journalist. You need real journalists to tell you what to think, eh? Highly amusing. Why are they covering your face? It's not that bad. Guys, who do you think got more wrong? The COVID scientists or the climate scientists? Or they're both the same, it's Bill Gates. Is he the number one scientist in climate and COVID? Why are there so many similarities? Do you think lockdowns is going to fix it? Lockdowns work so well with COVID, didn't it? 15 minute cities, that's the answer. Excuse me, do you think Bill Gates would be proud of the massive crowd you've got here today? Who do you think got more predictions wrong? The climate scientists or the COVID scientists? Or are they the same? Is it just Bill Gates? I see a critical thinker. It's your chance not to look stupid. No, you don't want to take it. Poor guy. There you go. 25, 30 sad protesters standing here, disrupting the working class to try to convince the working class to get on board, to believe the same scientists who locked us down for three years because the world was about to end and no one's really falling for it. Because fool me once, shame on you. Fool me twice, Shame on me. Have you many for Rebel News in Melbourne, Australia? If you enjoyed this report, make sure to like, comment, and most importantly, share it far and wide. Show the world what's really going extinct. This sad group of a protest movement. And then if you're anything like the growing movement of conspiracy theorists, Head over to rebelstore.com.au. Get yourself your T-shirt to let the world know your preferred pronouns. Rebelstore.com.au. Get your T-shirt. Check out all the merch. Look good. Stand for something. And support your favorite news network.